Dean Asher Smith, just how you feeling coming to Eugene and running what you did here? You, you're kind of used to the rain, but the sun came yeah. out. <laughs> I'm looking used to the rain, but I would always rather have the sun. It's amazing to come to Eugene. Um, obviously, the World Champs is here very soon, and um, yeah, it's a lovely stadium, and it's always an honor to race there. Racing as I did, meh, the race, it could have been better in parts. First half was good, second half was okay, but could have been better. So, um, overall, I'm a bit like, meh, if I'm being completely honest. But at the same time, that's why we kind of come and do these races because we learn of like how to how to just improve and, and yeah really yeah. warm up into the season nice and so you're actually kind of an elder states person when you're talking about your experience in the championships amongst the field I mean you made it in you know 2014 2015 was like kind of your entry to like the like senior. main main yeah. senior stage right um and you know like you and elaine are kind of like the elders and uh shelly and fraser prices of course you know mm -hmm. you all but how does it feel to you know be one of the more experienced athletes on the circuit right now um i think it's i think it's um definitely something that i'm i would definitely like to use to push together towards good performances because yeah i went pro when i was 16. so <laughs> it's been a very very like long road long time coming for me so um yeah i guess like just having that experience and knowing that knowing what kind of athlete i am knowing what the major championships environments are like um i think is a really useful tool because at the end of the day you can run as fast as you like on the circuit but you have to be able to go through the rounds and really perform when it matters and I'm just always very confident that when it matters, I know I can do it. Yeah, just two more. So, um, what, who are some of your role models that you looked up to as you were getting into the sport, even like um, outside of track? If you had oh, I think my main one would actually be Alison Felix. I love watching her run. She is so graceful and also just so good and so consistent. And you know, when it matters, she performed. And also Christina Horogu, who is one of those people who, when it matters, she pulled it out the bag. And I think that's really um, admirable. Nice. And then, uh, just two last questions. You. You do a lot in fashion and you're involved in a lot of different things now. But I'm curious if you are kind of like implanting yourself in different ways to prepare for after the sport, whenever it is you retire. Um, yeah, maybe. I'm honestly just being myself and just kind of expressing myself in different ways. I think in order to be able to perform as an athlete, you have to be happy like all around, all over. And um, that also means. Um, just making sure that you can have other spaces to express yourself and relax and you know because it is a high pressure sport high pressure job so it's important that you've just got ways to to kind of disappear and <laughs> and have a full and complete life off track nice and then last question so of course you do the 100 i mean this year you did the four the three the two you've been like dropping down but if you could do any yeah. event that's yeah. not an event you've oh. run before what would it be? Could be on the track, could be on the field. No hurdles. I'd love to be a hurdler. I let my coach kind of lets me um, play with the hurdles in training. And I know that's the, everybody that's everybody's face is like really? Sometimes I'd love to be a hurdler. I've always wanted to be a hurdler. I think it's just so good. It's just so um, exciting. Yeah, I'd love to be a hurdler. Well you got girls running like twelve two in the hurdles. What do you think you could do right now? I've got no, I prob honestly I'm so clumsy, I'd probably hit all of them. <laughs> If I'm being completely honest. <laughs> it'd be fun though. Yeah, it'll be fun. I would have fun. I might be lying on the floor, but it'll be fun. <laughs> nice. Well, Dean Smith, thank you so thank much. Thank you. Thank you.